backwards visualizing. Begin by accepting whatever you feel right now. Allowing yourself to feel whatever you feel. Whatever you feel, you feel. It's neither good or bad. It's just how you feel. Now allow something to come up that you'd like to experience, a final result you'd like to be, do, or have. Put your attention on the final result, on your wish already true. If your wish were already true, where would you be? Or with who would you be? If your wish were already true, how would you feel? Can you put your consciousness to a place of your wish already fulfilled. See that? Feel it, touch it, see what you can touch in that reality. What do you hear? And what can you smell or taste? And can you imagine that this whole thing already happened? This whole thing is a memory. It's 
It's not a fantasy, not a goal, not a desire. It's a memory. It's already happened. Can you imagine that? Can you pretend? And now we're going to use this so-called memory and walk backwards in time. So right before this reality manifested, what happened? Or what were you doing? We're going to walk it backwards several times up to the present moment. So right before it manifested, what happened? What were you doing? And right before that happened, what was going on in your life? What were you doing? Where were you? Perhaps who else was there, if anybody? Treat this as if it were a memory. And again, allow yourself to feel whatever you feel. Give yourself the space and time to feel what you feel. And without too much effort, become aware of what happened right before all of that. What were you doing before that? And of course, this is only one timeline, one version of events. 
I'm sure there are other variations of how the reality manifested step by step, but you're choosing one version, you're allowing it to come up. You're not efforting, you're simply allowing it to come up. And before this happened, what happened? Before this happened, what were you doing? And what happened before that? Getting closer now to the present moment. What was happening in your life or what were you doing before that? And the next step is the one prior to the present moment. What happened before that? And finally, arrive in the present, what happened before that? Well, before that, you were in the present moment. Be present. Be fully in touch with your body and being and whatever you feel. And we'll go through it again, more quickly this time. Put your attention on the final result you prefer. And what happened right before that? And what is something that happened before that?
and what was happening in your life before that. And how did that come to be? What happened before that? What would have had to have happened before that? The next step is the one before last. What happened before that? And arrive back in the present moment, what happened before that, the present moment happened. You've integrated the entire timeline and shown your subconscious one possible path. Now let go and leave the rest to your subconscious, going about your daily activities, following your hunch on what the next correct step is. And so be it. <laughs> 